I think it was 1989 when I was asked to become a development writer because mm -hmm. they needed some European yeah, or yeah. non-Japanese yeah, input. Yeah, yeah. There was no email then or... And so I sent a fax with all my details, you know, yeah. I am this, I raced this, I did this and this. I didn't hear anything for months and months, nothing. Mm -hmm. And then one night, it was you know, late, nine, ten o'clock, mm -hmm. the telephone mm -hmm. rang and it was Tanaka-san and he mm -hmm. said, uh, you applied for this job as mm -hmm. a test rider. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> and I said, yes. And the interview was, can you ride a bike fast? Mm -hmm. And I said, uh, yes. He said, okay, you've got job. And then he said to me, he said, you need to be in uh, Suzuka Circuit. Mm -hmm. uh, nine o'clock on yeah. Monday morning. Mm -hmm. And it was the Wednesday. Mm -hmm. I said, oh, I'm sorry. Uh, but I booked a holiday mm. to Greece or somewhere. Mm. We paid for this holiday, it's all booked and everything. Yeah. And he just said, uh, change it and put the phone down. And I did. How many bikes have you been involved with? Transop. Transop. Tobita. All of uh, Honda big of model. In the XR 750, Varadero. And Good. also Cross mm -hmm. ah. Now, mm -hmm. Mr. Asuka Ito. Ito-san. <coughs> He's just joined with Honda. It's a six, six years. Also Mr. Sasaki. It's already 25 years working with us. He's an expert rider of the motocross. Mm. Then he's two-stroke, uh, ATCC, 125, 250, and CR500 also. Oh, uh -huh. Then the, the latest was the CRF, uh, uh -huh. 450X, and also NC, 700, 100 in the year. I was in the It's a 12 years. Uh, work with us. 12 years. It's was still young. Mm. It's uh, recently, it's, uh, he worked with a big bike with the injection system. Mm. As, uh, I work with Honda. It's already over 30 years. I work with uh, NR750, it's CB1000R, and also CB1300, and also CB1100. I met Dave years ago and uh, you proposed me uh, two years ago to to come with you for a Genteki test. I was really happy mm -hmm. of that because it's a kind of honor to mm -hmm. be uh, part of uh, this team for uh, a maker like Honda. I joined Honda in 1992. At that time I joined a service department and about Genteki acti activity I start uh, collaborating in uh, 10 years ago. And of course, it's something that keeps my motivation very high because mm -hmm. it's so important to take part of this mm -hmm. group of people who can help. Yes. Uh, not so big help because all the work is done by yes. these guys. Yes. We are just uh, a small part of no, this. No, no, no. I think it's, uh, well, your job is very important because uh, we are Japanese. We don't know it's a Europe so deeply. For example, it's a, like uh, food. Mm. If we bring uh, some uh, raw food, it's a basic. Yeah. And it's good fish, just good fish. But we don't know it's a, what kind of pepper, what kind of uh, salt is a good for Europe. But the main thing is with Genteki in Europe is the fact that you're riding at the actual place mm. in, the, yeah. in the local environment, and that makes such a big difference. When you ride in Japan, I don't know whether you find that, you know, you, yeah. you, you're in this environment which is perfect. And then, like here yesterday, you've got you know, tractors and people going home from yeah. work. And yes. this last two days for me has been fantastic because the bike is now such an incredible thing to ride. You know, the noise, the exhaust note and the induction and the, you know, the vibration. And um, and as, as soon as I started riding it, I started smiling because I just thought this is exactly what we want. This is fantastic. Not only sound, yeah. I think it's everything is synchronized. Then it's, it can make mm. some emotional mm. feeling, mm. I think. Mm. It's accelerate. Uh, some pulse, sound. Yeah, 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 yeah. You described it as something with the, what did you call those drums or something that you said? Yeah, so you said it's a Japanese drums. Yeah. It's a wadaiko. So big, so looks like it's a three meter diameter big drum mm. with a big sound with a, a Japanese soul sound. Mm. It's like a, our bike's exhaust note. Mm, yeah, mm, right. But my, my immediate feeling yesterday when we rode the motorcycle for the mm. first time after several months mm. was this bike is completely different than the one we rode yeah, first yeah. time. Mm. So many, many, many improvements. I did not expect such yeah. a 
<laughs> the big improvement. Yeah, yeah, yeah mm. honestly. As compared with the one year before. Yeah, 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 yeah. To, to be honest, uh, one yeah, year yeah, ago yeah. I wasn't so excited yeah. as I was mm. yesterday. Yeah? Yeah. Mm. Completely different feeling. This kind of bike is typically uh, an invitation to, mm. to ride. Mm. You know, it's an invitation to, okay, mm. let it go and have mm. fun, mm. go cornering. You don't want to go back. I think with my experience anyway with the Honda is we've never been a follower. It goes right back to, uh, you know, Babasan with the Fireblade. Fire when all, all the dealers and everybody was, oh, we need a new superbike. Mm. And so then he produced this 900cc. Yeah. And we all said, well, we don't want 900cc. It's no good. He said, oh, please, please. Yeah. You know, it's, this is going to be special. And, um, but I remember Babasan saying, you're about to test a motorcycle mm. that's going to change the face of super sports mm. forever, mm. right? And I feel sincerely that yesterday we tested an adventure bike, mm. which is going to change the face mm. of the adventure yeah. world forever. So you can ride as you like. Mm. If you want fast, it's okay. Exactly. Yeah. If you find some uh, rough road, you can go. It's highway, you can go yeah. in town, also you can enjoy it.